Thursday today and today is a very good day because I found out my results for the national psychology exam and I passed. It's such a relief. It's one of like the best feelings ever. However, there is one small catch and that is everybody has asked me, does this mean you're a fully registered psychologist now? Unfortunately not. I'm not there quite yet in the field of psychology. It never ends. You never feel like you're finished. It always feels like there's something left to do. And I still have some things left that I need to get done in order to at least get my full registration. Just left the office. My work bestie got me a Christmas present. So now I really need to go out and buy her a Christmas present and also do some last minute Christmas shopping. Because of all of the study and work, I've just been so disorganized. I went to Lush and I got one of those little like gift box sets, which I thought was really sweet. I forgot to mention as well that tonight I'm going out with my team and we're going to celebrate the National Psych exam results and also Christmas. Yeah, I know, that's, that's, that's how We've all got our backpacks on, yeah. ready to case today. <laughs> Mark my words, 2024, I'm gonna buy a bike. I'm the witness, and uh, I'll make sure you like the bike. I'm gonna buy a bike, and I'm gonna become a psychologist. <laughs> I woke up this morning and I realized that I need to do like a life reset. Like basically I need to sit down and work out all the stuff I have left to get done to get my full registration. And I need to put my full heart and soul into just smashing the last bits out. And you know what? This is perfect timing because today I'm going to my parents' place to visit them for the holidays. So what better environment to be reflective and work out, work out a plan. <laughs> Saturday and I'm down at the coast and I've given myself one day to sort myself out. I've got lots that I need to get done. I need to figure out what I'm gonna do it and how. Basically, I just need to do a bit of planning. Basically, I've got four more pieces of assessment left. And if we actually try and draw out a little bit of a roadmap for what this could look like. The only thing that I have left to do are case reports. One of these case reports needs to go to APRA and then the other three need to be submitted to my supervisor. And that's a lot easier to do. Essentially what I'm aiming for is to try and get the APRA case report draft done before Christmas and then the good copy completed before the new year. And then I'd like to get the other three case reports for my supervisor finished by around the end of January, mid-February. And I know that's ambitious, but I am an ambitious person and I also am motivated by really wanting to get my registration. So today's the day that I'm gonna tackle the study. I'm gonna get into this case report, but the first thing that I have to do is prepare the space so that I can stay focused, motivated, and comfortable. So as you can see, my parents have taken over the study area with a 3,000 piece puzzle. And I think I'm gonna clear this space. Hopefully that's okay with them. <laughs> So I'm basically just going through the case report and checking out all the edits that I made with my supervisor. In supervision, he looked at it and he gave me some really useful feedback. As you can see, I've made quite a lot of notes. So there's quite a lot that I need to fix. But luckily I have actually done a lot of the draft. Um, everything highlighted in yellow, I need to change or add or write up. So basically I'm hoping that today I can smash a lot of this out. Just shut my laptop, it's around 5.15. And overall I'm pretty happy with how much I got done with my study. So I've been up since 5.30 and I've had this super productive morning. I've done my steps, I've done a workout, and now I'm gonna go into the office. On my lunch break now, it's been really productive this morning. So I sort of regret getting up at 5 a.m. Today no longer feels like the most productive day ever because I got home from work 
and I just kind of like collapse. Part of me just wants to go to bed and read my book. It's 8, 8.15 and I reckon I can probably do about 30 to 45 minutes of study. For all you crazy kids who also have to work and study, my hot tip is to make sure you take off all your makeup and brush your teeth and like get all that stuff out of the way. After you finish studying, you're gonna be so tired. You won't have the energy to look after yourself. Really, really wanna get into my bed. I have committed to this. And I'm accountable because I'm making a vlog. So I'm gonna stop studying at around 9.15. That's the target. I did it with time to spare. I'm very proud of myself. Even if it's not my best work, it's pretty good. I didn't really film the rest of my week because I'm burnt out and who really wants to watch me studying for a whole week? The good news though is that I got the draft done, it's now complete. My supervisor gave it a thumbs up, I have minimal editing to do, so according to the plan I am on track towards getting my registration, hopefully by around February. I'm so, I'm so, so, so excited, really tired and very motivated to get through this last hurdle.